Welcome to another edition of Carbs here on Reckless Eating. The only show where I sit in a car and BS while consuming carbs. Mad sign here. So I'm going to be doing something from Green Burrito, which they only have Green Burritos out here in California, at least in our area, that are with Carl's Jr. So I guess they're owned by the same company. It's probably Hardy's Carl's Jr. This is the barbecue brisket nachos, and it's beef brisket, barbecue sauce, cheddar cheese, and jalapenos. And there you go. Looks really good from the picture. Let's see if it holds up in person. This, uh, I did the drive through and I didn't notice this until I'd already ordered, so I walked back in and I bought this. Because I care about you guys. And I don't really see too many green burrito reviews on uh, YouTube. I seem to be the, uh, the king of that one. So, big box, cool. And these smell amazing. I'm just smelling like brisket and I'm smelling jalapenos but this looks really good. I actually think it looks fairly close to the presentation. Let's go ahead and get one that has just a little bit of everything. All right, here we go. The uh, brisket jalapeno beef thing. <laughs> oh my God. Oh God. Oh yes, that is amazing. That is easily the best thing I've ever had from Green Burrito. Woo, it's got a little bit of kick to it also. Oh, keep going, yeah. Mmm, that is yummy in my tummy. Holy crap, that's good. I'm kind of sad this is probably a limited time item because, oh, the jalapenos give it a nice kick. Barbecue sauce is really sweet. Brisket's got a great flavor. Cheese, not really tasting, but it's there. And the chips aren't soggy. They're nice, solid chips like you would get from any Mexican restaurant. Oh, it's so good. Mm. <laughs> it's a 540, I believe, for this. I think that's more than worth it. This is so good. Complaints? Only that I wish they put more brisket on it. There's not that much meat on it. I would pay a little more just for them to stack it on there. There's a few pieces that have a lot, but most of it is just a couple little slabs here and there. I want it just covered. I think that would be awesome. One more big bite and give the rating. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go ahead and subscribe to Death Toll's channel by clicking the annotation right there. Dettol is one of our Reckless Eating members, and he does, ironically enough, because this is kind of a hot food, hot sauces, extracts, and hot related foods and hot problems. He has them too, he's just like you, except he's hot. These are amazing. These are amazing. I really, my only complaint was that I wanted more brisket. Other than that, these are awesome. I would give these a very high five out of five. This is almost seal of approval if they just stacked a little more brisket on there because I feel like after a couple bites, the brisket started thinning out very quickly and I was left with just, a lot of the chips are plain. This is something that a lot of nacho, or places that sell nachos, they do this. If you go to like a nice Mexican restaurant, they will do that, it's kind of weird. Like the best place to get nachos out here is when you go and you order, because the nachos probably, right? Mexican restaurant, a nice Mexican restaurant is probably not the best place to get them. But you go to like the ghetto Mexican drive through like fast food places, and those, those are the perfect places to get nachos because they just cover everything. If they added a little more brisket, it would be a seal, but this is something you should go try. If you have a green burrito out by you, I don't know exactly where they spread out to, but go try this out. It is amazing. It, it is a definite must try. So there you go, guys. What are your thoughts on this product? Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you for joining me for this edition of Carbs here on Reckless Eating. We'll see you on the next one. Reckless Eating! Reckless Eating!